So, where do we go? Place looks huge from the outside. It's gotta have a mission control. Or command center. Or whatever the UIR call it. Hey, mission control is accurate enough. And keep going. It's close. Reckon there's even more bodies beneath all this sand. Way to keep it light, Files. Another door. Help me. This must be the place. Let's get some light in here. Well, the lights work at least. Let's say we found the rocket hack. Maybe I need new glasses, but I'm not seeing any rocket. Paddock, Baird. The hangar's empty. Well, shit. If the rocket was moved, there's gotta be a record of it. You know what? Hack into an access port. Let's see if Jack can bypass that virus. Hey, Jack. Let's pull some records. Okay, Jack's giving me a window into the mainframe. Ooh, that's some nasty malware. Adaptive. Semi-sentient. Don't worry. Jack's got this. Right, buddy? <laughs> no virus can stop, Jack. Huh, data's coming in. Got it. I assume you can read this? Yes, but much of it is encrypted. Okay, the rocket's nose cone is close. Check the assembly chamber on the other side of the hangar. Nose cone? What about the rocket? The hammer satellites are part of the nose cone. Go deal with that, and we'll keep digging on the rocket's location. Wilco, Delta out. All right, let's go find those satellites. Boss, you're past Gari. Did you have read those files? Nah. I was born in New Ephira. My parents wouldn't even speak as hard as me growing up. They didn't want to see me different. Okay. What now? Well, let's bring that, uh, platformy thing this way. It's called a gantry? Is it then? Jack, bring it over. Uber. Oi! Back here! This thing's our way across. Finally! Something I can drive! Come on, you lot! All aboard! Take us across. With pleasure. One thing, Joe. I mentioned how the UIR attacked that facility and tried to launch our Hammer of Dawn satellites. Yeah. I led that attack. Did? Why? To destroy the cog. Yeah, well, makes sense. Uh, these days, I'm somewhat less interested in destroying the cog. Good to know, Paddock. Okay, let's go. This way to the satellites. Give me a hand. Satellites here. Let's keep looking. 
static. I'm curious. How long did your siege against this place last? Three days. We attacked the moment Premier Deshinko sat down with your chairman to discuss the armistice. You hit us with the hammer first. We thought it was only fair to hit back. Okay. Warm, but we're back on track. Also, Paddock, the cog that hammered you 50 years ago isn't us. We're not them. Well, if you launch those satellites, you'll be doomed to make the same mistakes. What is this knob even on about? with this before Paddock starts talking again. I heard that. Marva. Now we have this one. Okay, they're on to us. About bloody time. One. So, let's keep looking for those satellites. Hey, there. 
They're down. Again. Come on. Oi! Man, look at this. Must have been quite a fight. It was. Paddock, you fought to launch the hammer yourself. But now you're saying it's a mistake. What gives? You launch, you buy us some time, but eventually they'll win. You must know this. No, I don't. Door's welded shut. Then that's the door you want. Jack, rip that Over. door. Shit. Here we go. All right, let's get set up. They're coming. Certainly. A handful. And another news. Jack got the door open. Good job. Just realized if my parents hadn't have left Asgard, my dad might have been here fighting off Paddock's men. Mm. You, Vascari. What did your father do? He was a surgeon. <laughs> then he was lucky. We shot every doctor we captured. Uh, can we turn him off? On the nose cone. Yeah, but it's missing satellites. Wait. I see the others. Either side of the chamber. Let's get on that gantry. We'll load them up one at a time. Good idea. I'll drive. Bring the gantry in closer, Jack. Just like the last one. Should we hit first? Make the call. Choices, choices. All right, off we go then. Um, having a problem, pal? No, just figuring it out. So our friend Pat has got some uh, interesting thoughts on the hammer of dawn. <laughs> Who's he to judge? He tried to launch it himself. Okay. Let's get that thing loaded onto the nose cone. Let's 
try this. There, satellite's on the move. Stay clear of that rail, people. Pretty on the nose cone. One down. Then let's get the gantry over to the other side. Right. On it. Yourselves, this might be a little rough. Hey, what if Paddock's right about launching these satellites? Oh shit! More on the other platform! The city ducks down here! Boss, get us higher! On it! <laughs> Oh, shit! This is the opposite of higher? I'm aware of that! Got it! Got it! Just keep us moving! Doing my best! Shit! Zion! And we got a bastard, too! Big guy's down. 
so we can connect the satellite. <clears throat> Let's get this done. like the other one. Satellite secure. Back onto the gantry. Let's get him to the hangar. Uh, not to burst any bubbles, but we're not getting anywhere till we open that big round door. Uh, well, there's a platform up there. Head over to it. You read my mind. All aboard! Up there. Okay, so what if Paddock's right? Launching the satellites is a bad idea. He's right that the ham is dangerous. Believe me, get that now. Not launching these satellites is dangerous. Believe me, a world on fire is better than the world they want. We get this thing back to the hangar. We worry about the rest later. Let's try this. Guys, our ride's leaving. God damn it. Opening that door must have triggered some automated sequence. So we babysit it on foot then. And I was just getting the anger driving it. These stairs. We can't lose that nose cone.
Keep up with it. Watch it below us. Here. There it is. Let's keep up. Paddock, Bear. We're escorting the satellites back to the hangar now. Good. We're still decrypting these old files, but we're making progress. Head out to your speed. We'll find your rock here soon enough. All right. We're on our way. Jack, we need some light. We're back in the hangar, we can work our way outside. Need some help. Okay, satellites are safe and sound. If we want to get out of here, we should cross to the other side. Looks like we're all clear. 
escape. Just so you know, whether we get the hammer working or not, I'm glad we came. Yeah, but if we don't get the hammer working, whether you came or not, it won't matter. Let's just find over there! Incoming! <laughs> What the hell is that? It's a carrier! And it's not alone! Back up, back up! Spread out! Don't let it pop us in! Just keep firing! burst apart like that. Yeah, pretty much. Our way out's above us. Let's get up there. would be so difficult. Hmm. Let's see. Scientists. Rocket scientists. And anyone who's used the expression, it's not rocket science. What do you think? We just push a button marked launch? Oh, I see. Yeah. Pick on the handsome one. Cut him down to size. So, we're back across. And for the record, <laughs> I'm the handsome one, okay? Paddock. We're almost out of here. Any leads on that rocket? Yes. It's at a turntable in the east, beyond the Dune Sea. There's a rail bridge blocking the way. But don't worry. My people will raise it for you. So, out in the desert, find train tracks. Then you'll know you're on the right path. Copy that. All right, let's head for the skiff. You know, all this time I thought I was the answer. Oh, dear God. Question for you. No, I'm on lunch break. Of course, I'm still here. Okay, what? The usual problems faced by 200 dedicated patriots trying to defeat 3,000 cowards. You know, you could just have agreed to the armistice and spared a lot of lives. A Groznian proverb for you a just war is better than an unjust peace. So, just exactly how many Garazian proverbs justify war? Eh, most of them. All right, let's head out. Children, one more thing. The bridge controls one network, so the base commander's virus didn't affect them. But the bridge itself hasn't been lifted in decades. 
What are you saying? You worried about your people not being able to raise it? No, they'll handle it. But that bridge, it's old and rusty and... Uh, just, when you're beneath it, don't linger. Copy that. All right, you heard him. Let's head for the bridge. So, this Paddock, how does Baird even know him? Apparently, Paddock served in the COG for a while. That guy was COG. When? Uh, unclear. They didn't seem that eager to talk about it either. Come on. Come on, let's get past the bridge and over to that turntable. Face in the wrong direction, which is why it's called a turn team. Grab the other side and let's get in. Okay, now how do we turn this thing? We started by finding a control. Hey, it's warm. Perfect. Ready when you are. <laughs>
train turned around. here looks like a control room to me now to access the toward the hangar. Just 
Yes, <laughs> 